Hello friends, this is Mohammed Shakil here and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can design an umbrella in Kitty IV5. Here you can see an umbrella designed and uh, I have used the generative shape design, part design, partly wireframe and surface design, then the material editor etc. to design this and uh, I'll be showing you step by step how you can achieve this design so stay tuned. So this is another design. So let me close it and start off with the design. To start off, open up the generative shape design workbench and you can name it as umbrella here. Umbrella study. Click on OK and a new workspace is being opened. Now to start off select this sketch and go for the YZ plane and once you're on the YZ plane select the three point arc and click on the center two three really easy. Select this constraint and give the radius and here you can give the height you can set the radius to 100 somewhere around 150 and you could uh, decrease the height to maybe 40 that would be okay then make sure that this line and this line I'm sorry this arc and the X makes it as tangent. Come out of the sketch and now select the YZ plane and go for create plane and select the angle normal to plane and give an angle of 12.5 degrees and select the rotation axis as Z axis really easy okay now what you could do next is to select this line and go for operation and create a symmetry with respect to this plane okay this is being done so that you can make use of these two lines and make a multi-section surface which would be later used to create the, create the cluster of our umbrella and select the ZX plane and again create a plane and make sure that you're going for angle normal to plane 12.5 degrees with respect to z-axis and click on OK. Now sketch on that particular new plane again and make sure when you're doing it your multi-section surface is hidden and project these two lines right here um, project this line too and select these two lines and make them hidden and then use the three point arc and first click, second click should be on the middle and make sure it's a solid line and the third click and make sure that you're leaving a little space from this point to this point maybe a 2mm space which could be later used to put a small bobs which would be seen on the end of the umbrella now you could come out of the sketch and that sketch would be somewhere far away over here which could be later projected over here to our multi-section surface which I'm going to show you in my next part of the tutorial so I hope you enjoyed this part and uh, stay tuned if you have any doubts on this particular part of the tutorial please comment below the video and I'll be getting in touch with you thank you so much for watching and thank you for your continued support thank you